Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will talk about dividing decimals by whole numbers. So without further ado, let's do this topic. So what we have here are four examples for us to solve under dividing decimals by a whole number. Now let's dive into the first example. What we have here is 4.86 to be divided by 9. Here, our 4.86 is your dividend, while this whole number 9 is your divisor. In this case, we can go directly divide these decimals using this whole number since our divisor is a whole number. So let's start dividing 4.86 by 9. First thing you need to do is to put a decimal point kung saan man nakatapat yung ating original decimal point sa ating dividend. And then, we can directly divide the decimals. Let's try. We have 4 divided by 9. So, it's not possible. It is 0. Next, 0 times 9. That is equal to 0. So, what we have here is we will subtract 4 minus 0. That is equal to 4. Then after that, we will bring down 8 here. So this 4 will become 48. This is our new dividend. 48 divided by 9. Again, 48 divided by 9 is equal to 5. 5 times 9, that is equal to 45. Then we will subtract. 48 minus 45 is equal to 3. Then we will bring down 6 here. It will become 36. This is our new dividend. 36 divided by 9 is 4. And this 4 to be multiplied by our divisor 9. 4 times 9 that is equal to 36. Subtract this, it will become 0. As you can see, the answer here is this. 0 0.54 so we could say that 4.86 divided by 9 is equal to 0 0.54 I hope na nakuha nyo yung first example natin on how to divide decimals using a whole number now let's move on with item number 2 for item number 2 we are given the decimals 8.3 for 2 divided by 2. First thing you need to do is to put a decimal point where the original, the decimal point of the dividend is placed. So, gagawin natin dito, 8 divided by 2 is equal to 4. 4 divide, times 2, that is equal to 8. So, we will subtract, this is equal to 0. Then, we will bring down 3. So what we have now is 3. 3 divided by 2 is equal to 1. 1 times 2, that is equal to 2. Then we will subtract. 3 minus 2 is equal to 1. Bring down 4. So what we have now as our new dividend is 14. 14 divided by 2, that is equal to 7. 7 times 2 is equal to 14. As you can see, in subtracting this one, it will become 0. And we still have another one to bring down that is equal to 2, so it will become 2. 2 divided by 2 is equal to 1. 1 times 2, that is equal to 2. And as you can see, this is 0. It simply means that the answer here is... 4.171 8.342 divided by 2 is equal to 4.171 So let's have our third example For the example, you can pause the video for a while and let us, you can try dividing 2.35 by 5 Again, you can pause the video for a while 
Now let's continue. Here, the dividend is 2.35. The divisor is 5. So first, we will put the decimal point here at the top of it. And let's start dividing. 2 divided by 5. Again, 2 divided by 5 is 0. 0 times 5 is 0. Subtract 2 minus 0 is 2. And we will bring down this number. And this is 3. So now, our new dividend is 23. 23 divided by 5. This is equal to 4. 4 times 5. That is 20. Subtract these numbers. 23 minus 20. This is 3. And we still have a number to bring down. And we have here 35. So 35 now divided by 5 is equal to 7. 7 times 5 which is equal to 35. Now subtracting this it will give you the answer of 0. Meaning we will stop dividing. Simply means that if you divide 2.35 by 5 that is equal to 0 0.47 and this is our answer guys now guys i hope na nakuha nyo yung first three examples natin on how to divide decimals by whole numbers and as part of our routine i want you to try this example in which sana makita ko sa ating comment section what is your answer when you divide 14.16 by 3? So guys, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe but hit the bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Gon. You can follow me here sa ating Facebook page. And maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!